Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Well today I want to do part 4 to my iPad and tablet gameplays. Um, I haven't done one of these in a little bit, in about 2 or 3 days. Uh, that's probably because like I said back in my Battle Revolution video, I was trying to get a lot of things done. And I'm kind of happy with the results, but I'm normally not kind of happy. Like, I'm happy with almost every single game but one. That's mainly the um the Sea Monster City that I have right here. The moment I'm not happy with its results because I didn't get over ten thousand, but I do got plenty of food or a lot of food. The problem is we're not winning many battles either. But on the same hand, we're still getting a lot of chances to like get food. Like for example, um, I've got three farms in that game that um I'm getting a lot of ton of food in. You don't have to worry about Dragon Sea, guys. Cause, I mean, not Dragon Sea, but, um... Dragon Village, because of the fact that, dang, you know, we got over, like, 500,000 food in there. And, like, we could literally, like, feed almost like, probably, uh, probably one dragon up to, like, level 50. Right now, if we wanted to. I don't think I want to do that, but I want to maybe feed some of the other dragons that are not high on the level yet. Including some more babies that we got. And the same time, I'm also going to be showing you some... Uh, two new games that I got, as you can see them. Right here. It's called Cloud Sheep 1 and 2. These are basically games where you're like taking care of sheep and raising them. It's basically the same as all these other games except like you're raising sheep. I think it's kind of different because like, they're, like the mechanics are a little bit different. You ain't just like you ain't just getting like different kinds of animals and then you're like breeding them and getting different kind of things. There's also a game kind of like this on the tablet too, but it's called Tiny Farm. And instead of just doing sheep, you've got a whole bunch of different farm animals like cows. Pigs, chickens, sheep as well. And yeah. I decided to actually do this one first one because of the fact that on a Jurassic Pixel Craft we actually got a good bit to do and we got a lot of new babies. So I can actually like grow them and plus it's like they keep growing with each level, so I kinda wanna do it, save that one for a last. In fact I'm gonna what I'll we'll be doing. What I'm gonna be doing is saving I'm gonna kinda go in order through, through all these games. Except for maybe the dragon on the iPad I'll be going through like in order through every game except for Dragon Village and see Jurassic Craft because I'm going to save those two for last. I do have something to do in my dream fish tank. Um, I've had two baby fish sitting there waiting to grow but I didn't grow them at all yet. I've been trying to breed new fish for a little while and haven't gotten anything new. So hopefully when I grow these two fish it will get something different. And yeah, the only thing we got hope for is we have enough coins. Um. I am gonna go ahead and get the the clouds and sheep game over with. They're kind of backwards though. I had the clouds and sheep two up front and the clouds and sheep one in the back, so I moved them around that way we can have them in a, excuse me in order. I do got a little bit to do for each of these games. For these two, I'm just gonna show them off, and if I like them, we can keep going with them. Dragon City, we got at least three or four dragons we can grow. Dragon Main Legends, we got one or two main three dragons we can grow. We got at least three dragons we can grow in Dragon Mania Legends. Dragon Village, we, oh, I just said we got like over 500,000 food, so we can get a bunch of dragons grow up, including some new babies if I got any. Sea Monster Seeds, what the only game we can be able to get as much done in, but that's because of the fact that like, we don't. We have a good bit of food, but it ain't like a ton, ton. It's enough to like, maybe get a few baby guys at the level 4, and maybe enough to get like one or two people at the level 7. But because of how much it takes, it may not be enough to get like well, everybody that I have right now. I am gonna try to kind of avoid. I'm gonna try to avoid getting any new animals, at least in the game, mainly until I get all my other ones to level seven. If I have any babies, I might try to avoid growing them, unless I know that's the only thing we have enough to do, like. My goal is to try to get as much done as possible in each video, so if, if I need to grow the baby guys, get a lot more done and fun. But uh, growing the adults is more like, uh, or growing more the like middle stage to a final evolution is better than, yeah, we'll stick with that. Um, Magic Carp Jump, we did get a lot done in the last video on that. Maybe in this episode we can get a new Magic Carp and even get like stuff done with him. I can get him done, I don't know. I haven't really messed with this, um, Splash game since I went off camera with it. 
I, I did kind of, I think, sell like the butterfly fish we got in the last episode, but other than that, that's about it. My dream fish tank, like I said, we had new animals we could sell or grow and like maybe breed them to get new ones. And then um, that fish adventure seasons, we can just continue breeding animals and growing them and all of that. It's just basically going to be kind of the same thing over and over with that game where we're breeding animals and growing them. Before we actually start, I'm going to let you listen to the background because of the fact that if you hear in a minute, I'm going to let you listen. If you listen for a minute, you can tell there's no noise. I'm going to let you listen for a second. If you hear anything, it's probably the TV, but other than that, there's no... I'm the only one in this house right now. And, uh, normally we have a noisy dog here, but he's actually laying down being a pretty good boy right now. So we actually got the house to ourselves with a pretty quiet dog. So if I wanted to read this tutorial out loud, I could. Normally in most games, the reason I don't read a tutorial like I said I'm going to is because of the fact that like, somebody's in the house and I don't want to get attracted any attention. Like, I don't want to attract any attention while me playing these games, you know? Alright. So, like, if it wasn't for that reason, I definitely would be reading the tutorials no matter what. Since I was in the house, though, I will read the tutorial for these two games. The two sheep games. They basically work the exact same way, but I think there's like a, maybe one or two different mechanics for each of them. Or for the second one. I don't quite remember, because it's been a while since I played. I just remember you had to get the raised sheep in this one. So, yeah, with that said, let's get started with the first game on the list. Which is this one. I'm going to see if it lets me turn it this way. Because I got like this way better. It will. Cool. Okay. It's asking me if I want to turn notifications. I'm not going to do that. But I will real quickly read the help menu. Because like I said, this is a brand new game for everyone. Like I said, this is mainly a thing where I can like... Where I've I'm mainly a series where I'm like playing little games for y'all. Most of these games, I think actually all these games will be about me raising animals. If you're wondering why I really got into this concept, like, I think I explained like in one of my earlier videos of this series. It was the fact that there was this one thing that I used to do on Facebook called Happy Pets. There was even another game like Castle where that one called Happy Aquarium. Like you, you got to raise like different animals and fish and all that and like. Every few days they would grow, you like get to raise them and like you can breed them and do all that and like you can like kind of do the same thing you do in these games. That's what really spawned my love for this stuff. I want to mention, I guess in a way that kind of likes the Pokemon as well. Um, I love like dragons and all that so finding games where you can like raise dragons is kind of in my interest. And it ain't just because of, just because of Pokemon, it's also because of the fact that like I used to like this show called Dragon Tales when I was little and like I like dragons because of that. I guess it was awesome because of that. I liked a bunch of different kind of animals. Oh, it's fun because I like more of the fantasy animals more than anything. Like, I like dragons. I like dinosaurs. I like... Well, I guess you wouldn't call dinosaurs fantasy because of the fact that, like, I guess back a million years ago, they were real. But, like, they all died off because of, like, either the Ice Age or the Asteroid or something like that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah... Um, anyway, this game does have, like, little mechanics to it, and I'm gonna kind of read those. The first little thing it says right here is, Throw a sheep. They love it. As weird as that sounds in this game, like, you can, like, um, the, uh, behind them, they have these little tails, or, like, these little puffballs on the back of them, which is their tail. No, duh. Um, and, like, you can, like, pull that back, and, like, you can, like, basically springboard them across the yard that you're taking care of them in and like they actually love it especially according to this thing and then the next thing says pull yeah pull the tail of a sheep to roll it but don't pull too hard that's the one i was just talking about you can actually throw this is i actually made a mistake you can actually throw your sheep by flicking your finger on them i'll kind of show you more mean to this one when we actually get started with the game but I don't quite remember if there's actually a tutorial. I think this might be a tutorial mainly. I also can't quite remember. Play with your sheep and collect their happy stars. I think their happy stars are mainly just used to like. Oh, uh, like buy stuff. Because I know in this game you can also buy like a few things, including like new sheep. But you have to have like happy stars to do it. I don't know how much. Since I like raising mainly the animals in this game, you know what, what, what I like to do is once they grow up, I like to mainly like get rid of the animals and then like sell them. Or like get rid of them and then like grow more. 
The problem with this game is I don't know if there's really a way to sell them and like mainly you have to like make them go to sleep forever with like lightning. Like literally there's like little lightning clouds you can create in this game. You're basically like you're basically like um you're basically like your own god in this kind of game where you can like except you're taking care of mainly just sheep and that's it. But you can like make rain happen, wood clouds, you can make thunder, I mean lightning happen. He can basically give water to the sheep and take them away. That kind of stuff. Like, it's kind of... It's kind of like you're the god of this game, basically. You always get more sheep to unlock new items and features. And then merge several clouds to make one big gray rain cloud. I know in this game also you can make it rain, but what what the point of merging a rain cloud is for is like if you want to feed your animals or not feed them, make them drink. Cause like I know in this game, some sometimes the sheep can get thirsty and like that will help them get like parched up and like really like make them not thirsty anymore. Yeah. Shake clouds to split them. I don't know really the point of this is but like I know like you can split clouds, but I don't know really the point of it is. I know this ain't the best tutorial, guys, but yo, what I would you like to do for you, for you guys is to let you watch and learn more than read and learn. Like, if there's a reading tutorial that somebody else is giving me, then great. Like on the, uh, like on the uh, Dragon Village, how they, how they had a little tutorial on that game that the guy was giving me. This game, I don't think has that, it just has this. Like, I'm not good at really give, conveying the directions a lot more simpler. I'm better at letting the guy kind of read it himself. Small pole plus light equals grass, and then small pole plus rain equals large pole. Yeah, I know your I know your um sheep have to eat in this game as well, so like that's what that's kind of for. If you give them if it, there's a small pole plus some light from like the sun, like you can make some grass for them to eat. But if there's like a small puddle plus some rain, you can make a bigger pole for them to drink out of. So like that's basically a way to get them some food and drink in this game. Feed your sheep flowers to get them into the mood for love. And that's basically where the breeding part of this game comes in. If you feed them, like what like what this game says, if you feed them flowers and get them like kind of love each other, they'll like make another sheep. And like you can kind of continue the process over and over again. Or you can like just earn up enough stars and buy more sheep. I don't quite remember when that part of the game comes in. If you can buy them off the bar, it has to be a little bit later in the game. I don't quite remember actually. But yeah. Female and male sheep can be distinguished by their eyes. Yeah, the females will have eyebrows and like the when the eyebrows with the eyelashes and the males won't. If a big cart hits a cloud, a new sheep is born. And the clouds kinda come handy for breeding too because of the fact that you need um what if it hits that you can make a new sheep. Yeah. Keep wet sheep warm and get and dry or they will get ill. I don't quite remember how that works out to I think they can actually get sick and actually like go to sleep forever themselves if you don't take care of them good enough. I don't quite remember though. I know like if you like create a, a big enough cloud you, you can make a thunder cloud where like you can make lightning come out of it. Like you can make it hit one of your sheep, and that would not it will, it will make them go to sleep forever. You hit them enough. Which, if that's the way I need to keep this like pr keep this game going, I might do it. And just so I know that what I ain't trying to like do that on purpose. I just like I have something to do for you guys. That's the problem with doing these videos. I have to have something to do, or it's like, what's the point of doing a video like that? That's why I haven't seen one in like two days, and I'm probably gonna, it's probably gonna be that process kind of every single time I do a video now. You might see one to two. Or more days, like even like maybe a week, depending on how much work I'm putting in each game. Overhead sheep need shade to cool down. Yeah. Oh my god! Look at all this crap. Yeah, and <laughs> and that's the like the going to sleep forever sheep become quiet. I know I ain't reading. I I ain't gonna read the whole story. I I, I should have kind of done it, but nah. I'm kind of seeing, I'm seeing what the, okay, 
Why are you gonna start this game? Like I said, it's mainly just you raising sheep, and that's it. Yeah. As you can see right here with these three. I don't know if I've actually have enough to grow the sheep, but I know if you like click on these signs right here, like they'll give you like a little tutorial on what to do. Welcome to the pasture. I always look out for future signs. And like see they're expecting you to know to do this. They're teaching you right now. Like I said, there's a little bit of tool with this game, but I was kinda of expecting it then being to help me and you I kinda of forgot about this part. Carry your sheep to the next tuft of grass. Eating brings happiness. Yeah, see, like, this is what I mean. You can pick them up and, like, they'll eat the, they'll eat the grass, like you see there. I don't know if you have to do it for all three, but I'm going to try it. Oh, yeah. Throw a sheep. They love it. Yeah, this is a part of the tutorial. If I actually turn the volume up, you can actually hear them. Like making sounds. Like I'll show you again. If you like throw them and all that. Let's see. Where'd he go? Oh my. I'm doing pretty far. What's this saying to do? Pull the tail of a sheep to roll it, but don't pull too hard. Oh, see, I don't really know, I don't know why they love that, I don't like that. I don't know if they even do, but I know they like being thrown, which I wouldn't like. And if I was a sheep, I wouldn't want to be thrown across a daggum yard. Continue playing with your sheep and collect their happy stars. They actually want me to do this, I don't... Once they start collecting happy stars, I can start collecting them, but right now... Once they start getting happy stars, I'll start collecting them, but right now I don't see any. I'm trying to see if I can get one, two, actually. That was cute. Did you hear it yawn? I'm trying to see if I can get them to produce the stars. Oh, that sounds bad. Oh, hey. There you go. How much you did it? You gave me another one. You hungry there? He is hungry. Let's see what this is about. Collect happy stars and use them to buy new sheep. So let the sheep... I can't have on the pasture. I don't have enough stars right now. I gotta get one more. I see they ain't even available right off the bat. You have to have enough happy stars to get them. All oh, those sounds are making. Bang! Now, if I get one more happy star, this would be good for me. Sorry, buddy. Those, uh, one thing I do I can say about this game is the fact that, like how cute the reactions are. I like how like cute they are just walking around. They don't look happy though, which is kind of saddening. He looks tired. Maybe they're thirsty, but I have no, not really many clouds to make. Whoa, never mind. There's a. Here's where the baby sheep actually come in though. Um. It takes a little while, but if you can take care of the sheep that comes out, or like you buy from the store, or they breed, they'll actually like grow into these kind of sheep. Enjoy what I like to do. I don't think you can sell them, but if possible, I might with wood. I would not want to hurt these sheep if possible, but I may have to at some point. Right now, I'm going to see if I can get them something to drink. Merge, gosh dang it. Hmm. All right, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and take care of one more sheep real quick. Actually, I'm running out of stuff. I might not want to do that. Let's go and buy the baby sheep. Like well, as you can see, there's a baby one right there, and he'll he'll grow up. At, Whenever you take care of him enough, or he'll grow up eventually, it just takes a little while. Merge several clouds to make one big gray cloud. <laughs> Let me see if you... I have never seen a fish sheep grow that quick. Usually it takes about, what, five minutes. 
Oh my god. How on how on the planet Earth did that happen? I'm gonna make it um, a great one. Rain longer on one spot to create large paws for thirsty sheep. With a bit of sunlight, small paws can grow in the grass. Fruit for free. Yeah. Shake clouds to split them. Yeah. I didn't tell it to grow. I didn't tell it to merge back. Okay, that's weird. Also, this is the main gist of the game, but it's actually kind of good. For, uh, I just didn't. I'm still kind of shocked that that cloud, uh, or not that cloud, but that sheep like grew back. I'm trying to find a sign. Keep wet sheep warm and dry, or they will get ill. Oh. Oh, come on. Let's call it stop rain and tell it to do that. Well, let's keep it warm. Is that, is that how it works? Where's the sun? I can't I can't run. I always get more sheep to unlock new items and features. I don't have enough to do it right now. Where's the sunlight again? Rain longer on one spot to create a large place for thirsty sheep. There we go. Okay, I like to make a play by doing that. I made that one happy. I'm gonna try some. I'm gonna get another one. I was trying to grab that. Is this game glitching? I swear. This game's glitching. I didn't tell you to rain. Get back over there. Let's buy a new sheet. I wanna see if this one grows as big or. Grows as fast as the other ones. The other one grew insanely quick for some weird reason. Right there. How? I honestly want to know how. I don't know where the warm daggum sunlight is. I don't honestly know how you do that one. Are you serious? Why is this thing raining again? Over time, sheep become tired and lie down to sleep. Oh, coffee. I don't want to give a sheep coffee. Oh, get out of the rain, little buddy. There you go. Oh, come on. Try to make them up. Oh, there we go. Try to make them happy, but we can start getting more happy stars like this. 
Oh my gosh, we're so get, we're actually getting a lot now. We've already got five. There you go. Oh my. I don't want to get in the rain, buddy. Come on. Hey, why are you walking in the rain? I'm trying to get your wet. I don't want you getting ill. Come on, man. Look at this. They're walking into the rain. Are you one in the rain? Look at this. They're one in the rain at this point. What are y'all doing? Oh, wow. They actually... Okay. Wow. There we go. Three more and we can get a new sheep. What's this? Feed your sheep flowers to get them into the mood for love. Dear God. Where's the other flower? Like, is there supposed to be another one somewhere? The game is ad supported. Please make sure that your device is connected to the end. Continue with ads. Okay. Uh. Why do I keep getting... There we go. Can somebody eat the flowers, please? Purchase flowers for a male and... Okay. already did. Here. There we go. Oh my god. I don't think we have a cloud bow. Oh, we have a small one. We have that one. There we go. Oh, that's cute. Oh, well, I'm gonna run out of room for these things. Don't tell me to eat that flower. Are you already gonna fall in love? Wow, these sheep are going fast. Look at all these sheep. Look. Oh, no, we're making a lot. We're getting a lot of... Nah. Look at how many sheep we've already gotten. <laughs> They're growing really quick, too. Like, if I don't grow in a second. Yeah, see? Like, honestly, usually guys take about five, like, three to five minutes for each one to grow. This is the cool I've actually seen them grow. Now, if I, if I continue to create, now I could actually make, like, um, a, uh, giant thunder cloud. And, like...
if you uh, do that. As you can see, they'll eventually, you know, it's kind of dark, but in the same way, like, that gets you less sheep, and, like, that just makes room for more, so, like, it ain't so bad if you think about it. I don't know why I struck that one, though. I'm sorry. Like I said, mm-hmm. <laughs> You can get rid of all the sheep if you want to. Which I might, I might do just so we can kind of have something else to do. Like, I would like this game, actually, if you hit... Like, I know it seems dark, but in our way, like, we're getting a lot of stuff to do, ain't we? Again, it seems dark, but I mean, like now you can just like make more sheep. Oh my God! Holy shoot! I forgot it actually does that. I forgot it actually does that itself. What does this say? We have to get more sheep. We have nothing else we can do. I said this game won't. This game actually kind of good. Whoa. I like this game a lot, but it, it can get kind of boring after a while. Let's see. <laughs> These sheep are kind of cute, ain't gonna lie. I like the sound of them, mate. Oh, no, 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 no. That was about to strike one of them. That is sucked. Attention, thunderclouds. Lightning can injure and kill sheep. Yeah. Sheep are injured or poisoned. Give them an in injection. Like I said, this can be kind of fun, guys, but it can also be kind of boring. That way we don't spend time on each game. I'm going to go and get the second version of this, because we got audience to get to as well. And it's basically the same thing as the first one. I don't quite remember if they change up anything from the first and second version. I also don't quite remember if they do. If they do, I don't remember it. This will be a fun game we can do every once in a while, but I don't expect us to do it too, if we do do it, not to do it too, 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 too long. I might have to turn that music off if it'll let me. I'm turning that music off. I'm turning the music off. Music, 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 music. There. Sound if I leave on, but music has to go off. There we go. I see there's anything different from the, the second version, from the first version. The sheep definitely do look different, and it's giving like a different kind of tutorial. Oh, yeah, and the sheep do kind of talk in this one. So, yeah, I'm going to kind of run right this. Bye! I'm Buddy, your first sheep. Nice to meet you. Oh, my God, I have to read this. You know, on your own flock of sheep, i show you how everything works. i show you great English. First, let's find something to eat. I'm hungry. Carry your sheep to a turf of grass.
You can also tell me which direction to face. Tap on the sheep's head to make it turn around. Yeah, I thought that kind of neat. Okay. Oh. Tap on the sheep's head to make it... I, I've done that. Oh, I'm going to do it three times. There we go. Now let's have some fun. I want to fly through the air. I still don't understand how they find this fun. I know it's a game, but still, how do they find this fun? Meh. Meh. Hello, doggy. Let me show you another cool trick. Yep, the rolling thing. Pull on a sheep's tail to make it roll. That was fun. Now it's time for happy stars. Give your sheep some time so it can create a happy star. Basically, something is the first game, so like the guys kind of more updated. If I am happy, you'll get happy stars. So let's continue playing. New quest: throw and roll your sheep to get more happy stars. I don't buy anything yet, or Manoa. We there you go. Who's whistling? Is that the sheep? Get a new sheep for your flock. Yeah, there we go. I wonder if they're going to grow nearly, nearly as fast as the ones in the other game. I still find that kind of weird how they were. With each solved quest, you can collect the experience bubbles. If you have quite enough experience, you level up and unlock cool new stuff. Alright. Okay, this one's definitely taking a little bit longer to grow up. I don't know who it, I don't know why. Usually in the first game it takes a long time, and this one's taking a little bit longer. I also don't know why it's taking so long or why it didn't take that long last time. Off right, you zoom in. Wow. I ain't even thinking you zoom in, so. <laughs> I honestly can't quite remember how they grow up in this game either, so. <laughs> Dirty, is that what it says? We need bigger clouds for rain. Oh, another one. Let zoom out again. There we go. Oh, I'm pressing. Oh, I want to we'll get detail about the about an item. Let me get it real quick. Our sheep at the same time. We have to fulfill their needs. I'm trying to see how they grow in this game. I don't quite remember this. I'm still kind of shocked at how slow it's doing in this game compared to the first game how it was. No, this is how long it takes to the first game, but it hasn't been taking this long this time. That's what I want to delete. That's cool. I don't know. Oh my god, where are you going? <laughs> nah. 
Rain's important. It lets things grow. Yeah. All the guys can maybe use it to grow grass now, ain't they? Yeah. We're getting a lot of heavy stars from you over there. Like when he grows up, we're getting heavy stars from him, too. Are you thirsty? Hey, look at he's drinking. Whoops, I didn't mean to grab your tail. I'm trying to grab you. I didn't mean to grab your tail, I didn't mean to grab you. I think you've actually you you gotten close to each other to watch you like communicate. What they're kind of trying to do now. But what ring card is that? Oh my gosh, I didn't know that ring card still there. I'm trying to even iron hands on it. This is taking a little while to grow. I honestly am not used to that now because the first thing not being taking that one to grow up. Ah, I don't want to grab your tail. I keep doing that. I'm trying to, every time I'm trying to grab you. Grass can only grow from small paws. But large paws provide much more water to drink. I know that stuff. I like said most of the stuff we saw in the last game, so mainly I'm just waiting to see how long it takes this sheep to grow because it didn't take so long last time. Or it didn't take so long last time. Why do you keep going over there? Stay over here. I think, I think, like, for this game, it's kind of, like, different. I think, like, they'll kind of, like, sneeze and grow. It's kind of weird. Like, they'll grow when they sneeze or something like that. Like, they'll sneeze and, like, get a little bit bigger or something. It's kind of weird, I know, but I think it's, like, kind of weird. You'll see whenever it happens. I keep drilling over their nest picture. I'm trying to see the difference. Yeah, see, this is taking a lot longer. I think this has already been, what, five minutes now? Oh my god. See, I was about to tap on it. I was about to tap on it. But you do have enough to buy another one if we want to. Well, oh, screw it. I know like, if you have enough stars for it, you can like paint your paint your sheep different colors as well. I don't have enough for do it now. Since I used them to uh since I used them to um yeah, this game I'm not really into as much as I was the first one. I'm not really into either any any of these, but more bit more these than the other ones. Other than the second and the first one. I mean, I'm a little bit more into to the other one than I am this one. <laughs> is that the other one talking to me? It is. I just do. Oh, I said I used over two. Okay. I'm not as big of a fan of this, of this game as I was the first one. I'm probably gonna get rid of this one anyway. So let's. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and think. Well, I'm gonna get rid of the second one and that's how I would do with the first one. Like I said, this, 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 whoop. Did you see the thing about fall? The first one was fun, the second one wasn't nearly as much. I don't think about what to do with both of them. And that one's going away. Um. Now, my question is do I wanna go in order or do I wanna get the ones that. 
I did say I want I kinda wanna save them ones for last the United City and Sea Monster one. Um, so yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna go ahead and do every one but the Dragon Village and Sea Monster one now. Or I'm gonna do every one of them but in order. Put them in order. I'm not used to hearing the music because I didn't used to have not used to having the volume up either. Wow, okay, that's new. I'm, I'm gonna mute that though. There we go. I only got eight minutes. I did get rid of the wind guy because that guy was actually about to grow, so yeah. I did get rid of this, that 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 wing guy I had before, and we do got a new guy right here in the flame guy, which is just this guy all over again. So yeah, we can just sell him. I'm real quickly. We do got four babies we can grow here. We got a guy called the Big Rocker Dragon. We got uh the Blizzard Dragon, the Frost, the Majito Dragon, or how we say that one, and then we got the Dark Dragon and then the Wind Dragon. So we got five. I'm actually not gonna. Actually, we got six now because we got that one. I'm actually gonna go and kind of do an. Or, well, not. I'm gonna go and do the. May not in order, but I'm gonna go and do the guy I just got since we've already seen his growth or see what he kind of looks like as he gets bigger. I know this game is gonna go by kind of quickly, guys, but I got other games to get to and they're more. Not more preferable per se, but they're ones I got a lot of do and a lot more important stuff per se. So yeah. We're gonna go ahead and. I'm gonna go and play the animation even though we already know what it is. I wanna see something real quick. Let me see if they make any sound whenever they do something. No, they don't. I was just seeing if they did, because I'd be pretty sick if they could. Let's go ahead and grow them. I ain't gonna lie though, going from that stage up to his final, he's pretty big. Like he goes from this stage all the way to this one. He is pretty big. I do like the look of him a lot. So we got the blizzard guy. We got the dark guy in here. We got this guy, which I'm gonna go ahead and do him because he, I don't really like the look of him. I'm gonna make sure we ain't missing anybody else. We got the big roster guy. I'm trying to make sure real quick. The big roster guy, wizard, and you, and wind, and dark. So we've got to do. I'm gonna go and get them. I really don't like the look of, um, where'd he go? This dude right here. He's a new guy, but he's super ugly. The Mojito guy, whatever. You know that it's summer when you see Mojitos everywhere. Invite this refreshing dragon to your islands, and we can guarantee it the party will never stop. Oh my god. This is the only animation since this is a new one. This is a weird guy. I don't know. I know there's some guys like similar to this. Like there's some guys that uh, some dragons that were just playing weird on here. And uh, there's one that looks weird but kind of cool at the same time. It's called the Bubblegum Dragon. It's really cool but kind of 
creepy looking at the same time. So yeah, if I ever get it again, I'll show it to you. Right now we're going to grow this. This guy I've never seen before, so it's going to be a new growth stage for me too. Let's see what he grows into. Oh my god, just the thing with feet. This is so weird to me. I hate this thing. This thing is so creepy. I hate it. I honestly do. Look how creepy this thing is. I'm glad I'm getting this guy because I don't like him. Okay, that got a lot bigger though. He went from like a small dude all the way to this. Dear God. I can only give one one thing to this guy. He did get a lot bigger compared to what he was. Like out of all of them, that's definitely my least favorite one so far. I hate the look of that one. I'm trying to keep up which one I need to do still because I don't want to lose any of them. I don't want to miss any of them and then have to come back and be like, oh yeah. I still have to do you. I am going to do the wing guys. Well, I should have done that before I did. We well, already know what he looks like, so we're going to just quickly grow him as well. Even though we play his animations, I'm going to go and play him real quick. There we go. There we go. He did get pretty big, though. This guy just looks too creepy for me. Same thing with the Mojita guy. I don't like the look of that thing either. Of course, I prefer the wing guy over him. Because he... at least the wing guy actually kind of looks like a dragon. The Mojita just kind of looks like... I just don't like the look of that thing. Big Rockster. I'm trying to... We got the big Rockster left. He's, he looks like one of the cooler giants. I hope he grows into something cool. The Blizzard. The Dark. Big Roster, Blizzard, and Dark, I think it's the last three. R Big Roster. Blizzard and Dark. Yep. I know where the last three are. Or, uh, I ran with them. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and do the Dark guy next, because he's one of them I've already grown before. He, he's a really cool guy, and he gets pretty big. I like the look of him. Here's the little animation when he's uh, small. I say he gets pretty big. And his final stage is pretty big too. Like I think his final stage is huge actually. As you see, he's a pretty cool looking dragon. I really do like the look of him. The dog's barking now. I'm not barking, but whining. It was quiet in this room until that, until I was saying that earlier. We got the big roster left, and then the blizzard. That's actually it, big roster and blizzard. The blizzard's over here. I'm going to say the big roster for a laugh, because of the fact that he's one that I'm kind of looking forward to. And the blizzard, I think, is new as well, so I can't wait to see what he looks like either. I'm going to read a description of him, because he is new, somebody I've never seen before, I believe. So, yeah. Weirdly enough, this dragon made of snow and ice seems to like hot and wet environments. Seeing this rare dragon flop around in a pile of lava is definitely worth the effort. I don't know what he was going to look like. Wow. That changed dramatically. He was pretty cool. Not only did like change her map, but he was pretty cool. Oh, that's sick looking. I love that one. Look at that one. I love the look of it. Dude, that one's sick. I love the look of that dragon. The last one we gotta do, I believe, is the big roster. Him. I'm making sure real quick before we actually do it that I don't want to miss nobody. I'm 
I'm gonna breed somebody after that. I wanna breed some of the newer ones. I'm gonna go ahead and do the big roster one. I believe uh, I don't think he's in this habitat. He's in one of these habitats over here on the right hand side. He's in this one. Right here. The big roster dragon is a rebel and a master at breaking the rules. He goes to do what he wants, when he wants. This includes having having hour long guitar sessions at all hours of the night. Even his little baby's age is kinda cute or cool. Look at this. Is that not cool? And like I'm not I don't even know what his gross age look like, so I'm kinda I'm really honestly excited to see what he looks like as an adult. He already looks pretty cool as well. Oh my gosh. I don't know, probably won't, but I'm going to go and see if like, he has a stage 10 growth. I'm just going to make sure. I want to see if like... No, I was just making sure. But that'd be kind of sick if he did. Like, that giant's awesome looking. But yeah, that's all of them I got to grow in this one, actually. Now we gotta do Dragon Mania Legends. We do got a few, we got like three or four new guys we can do in this one, including one that took like 16 or 15 more hours to grow or hatch from an egg. So, like, I'm kind of excited to see what he looks like. He's brand new to me as well, so I don't know what the heck he's gonna look like when he grows up. Kind of hoping he looks really cool. I think it's probably like the Peacock Dragon or something like that. And as you can see, if we, I've, I, I've been doing this for 108 days. And I own a road because I had this game deleted for a long time. But um, I've gotten, when I first started, when I did this game, I had it for 108 days before. So, like, if I wait about 12 more days and so about a week and a half or so, I'll have a new dragon, the Pharaoh, Pharaoh Dragon. We won't be having a new baby dragon in this game for a while though, because this one takes about 18 hours to get done. It says two hours on here, but trust me, I had to wait a long time for that, that to actually get done. So yeah. The main thing for this game is just to get as much stuff grown up as possible. We got a smoke guy in here. We got this guy. It's the smoke dragon. We got two guys in... Oh my god, we got an ad. That's just stupid as frick. You can go suffer for all I care. Uh, we got two and we got two drones in this habitat. This guy, which is the newest guy on here, which is the one I just talked about. And then we got this guy, which I've had before, the bee dragon. Then we want to win grow. Um, some more on the level 7 if we want to. We got, I think, one guy we can grow level 7. Let's see if we can get a different growth stage. We also got somebody else on the other side over here. We got this dude over here. So we got about three guys we can grow over here. And here's the guy that's level... Oh, we can get to level 7. I know you guys never seen him, but... I'm hoping that maybe we'll get lucky enough that maybe he'll have a different growth stage. I'm going to go and do him first just to get him out of the way because I'm hoping that he'll get... Hopefully, like, he'll get a little bit bigger. I swear it was he's shrinking. Like, do you notice how... Like, this is what I'm talking about. They actually do change when they go a little bit higher levels. It looks like he's shrinking. Like, look. Does it only at least shrunk a little bit? Let's see something. I was trying to see because it seems like it swears another. I guess swear it was he's gotten like a little bit smaller. I can't really tell anymore though. I 
I'm going to do the guys I've already seen first. So I'm going to go ahead and do the B guy over here on the left hand side. And then I'll do, I'll save this guy for last. I'll do the purple guy on the other side up next after this guy. I'm going to go and pay him right now. Well, I'm going to go and pay him twice and then I'll pay him once and then I don't. Oopsie. There you go. He's kind of, he's cute. Let's go and pet him. Or let's go and feed him. I'm trying to see if there's any difference in their growth age even as a baby. That would be kind of cool if it was. Look at he's skipping and jumping away too. Ain't this, is that not cute? He's just skipping. Look at him. Oh. And I ain't gonna lie, he's pretty cool as, a, as an adult too. I'm trying to honestly see. Let me see if I can get him closer. I also like to see if I can see if there's any difference in the growth rate. I swear sometimes it was they're getting smaller whenever they get a little bit bigger. But you notice how he was pretty big when he first started. Now it's, he looks really tiny again. Oh wait, did I pet you for you last time? I want to pet him. Oh my god. Ghost. Oh no. Thank you. There you go. Look at him. He actually kind of looks like a dog if you think about it. And I like the look of him too. I'm going to go ahead and do him over here now. Because like I said, I've seen... I've seen this guy grow before, so I kind of know what his stage is going to look like. I think y'all seen him too. I think I showed you him as like an adult beforehand. He is kind of slow, but he's also a cool looking monster or a dragon when he grows up. As you can see. I'm trying to get all these guys grown up, guys, especially that new one about to grow in a minute. This guy looks awesome, and I also do love the look of him. Once he gets done feeding or eating these, I will go ahead and I will finish eating real quick. Most of, guys, most of these guys that look like this, the only problem I have with them is they're kind of slow. Other than that, I actually do really like them. Especially, he would, look how cute he looks when he's doing that, too. He's like holding his mouth, I'm like, give me more, give me more, please. He's kind of cute, I love him. Anyway, let me see something. Okay, never mind. Um, we're going to go and grow this guy next. He, look, he looks kind of cute. Actually, he looks really cute. And I'm really kind of curious on what he's going to look like when he grows up. Hope me looks cool as crap, though. I'm going to give him, um, there we go. I'm going to let him eat the rest of the food before I give him the last one. Since he's gonna be a new guy. Holy dang. Look at this. Oh my gosh, he looks so cool. I swear it looks like he's growing. I guess where some of these people would be shrink and someone looks like they're growing. I think this guy's actually kind of growing. I can't tell though. I said we did have a few thing, a few guys we could grow here. We just did them. And I don't care what my little pony can go away now. I don't. I'm not doing my little pony. Get the heck out of my face. I hate my little pony. 
Okay. Anyway, this we won't probably be able to do this game for a while. You probably definitely won't see another video of this these videos for a while. Just the fact like most of these games now will probably have nothing to do. Like we probably wouldn't do anything. Because the fact like most of these eggs now are gonna take a while. Like for example, um. This egg, or this egg right here, I think, after it gets done hatching, or after it gets done getting bred, um, we have to still wait on it to hatch, and that takes about, like, 18 hours or something like that, or 11 hours. Like, it's gonna be a while for it hatches, and even when it does, I still want to get as many more eggs as possible. I do like to have at least three or four dragons ready to, like, grow for each game, or animal in general. Fish, dragons, that kind of thing. The reason why I'm actually going back here is so I can actually get dragons to breed. I actually forgot to breed them before I left, so I'm going to go ahead and breed them before we actually get started. Yep. I'm going to breed the big roster guy with somebody else. Uh, where's the, where's the, um... Let's do the big roster with the dark. It's going to take eight hours to do. Okay, hopefully we'll get something new out of that. Like I said, I just was trying to get somebody to breed that we'll have some more eggs coming our way. I forgot to do that before we left, so. I'm going to save Dragon Village and all that for last. So I'm going to go ahead and do Magic Carp Jump and all that next. I don't know how far we'll get on this game. I really don't. Hopefully, maybe we can get maybe we'll get this magic card done today. I don't know. I forget kind of what level we were at, but I know we were close to done. Yeah, level well, sixteen. We were a little bit. We we were pretty close to done for having another magic card. I'm gonna go and start by letting this thing give us a bunch of food so we can get as far as we can. I'm kind of curious how many how much food I mean how much how many coins do we got? I honestly don't quite remember how many coins we got. I don't know that way. That way I can get a. Uh, that way I can see if I can upgrade anything. That'd be nice. Let's see. We almost got it already. Almost 1215 already. How many coins are I got? Show me 35. I'm gonna have more than that. Do I have enough to buy friendship items? So I have 195 of these. Boost rank for bonus jump points. Okay, let's just go ahead and use that. If I can get enough to get Charizard to help me out, I would be so happy. I'd love for Charizard helping me out here. Honestly, if I could, that'd be great. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can try out this magic card. I think they'll give this, then they'll give us the train points back if we can do this without. Or if we can get a new match with them that goes to train points back anyway, so we're good. Hopefully, if I can get this match card anyway. What was that? I'm trying to get as much jump points as I can, guys. I always want to get this magic card done this episode. I may say the next one for the next episode. Please let it be the magic card, dude, or the massage card. Nugget sucks. You were giving me like 
50 coins. He went for 50. 7. You suck, Nugget. I honestly hate when Nugget shows up to like, dang him. He has like the worst crap. He doesn't give you anything good. Can that Masajikarp dude show up? We're not even going to get to level 15. I thought we would, but nope. Doesn't look like it. My car's not doing good on this train day either. How many trains does I got anyway? 13. I don't want to waste them on this one match car, but I actually want to have some for. I us say. My first power becomes clear when it has grown about two thirds of the way towards the max level. Screw I'm using at least one. I want to at least have enough to get to level 15. As I'm saying, this is why I don't get much done this game no more, because there ain't really nothing we can do. Like, we got a lot done last time, I don't know how anymore. I honestly don't know how we got so much done. Trying to get somewhere, guys. I want you to have something to do in this game. I've got other games, yes, but I just want to have something to do in this game. I'm saying if we don't forget nothing to do in this game, I might just start getting rid of it. If we don't get at least a gray after I'm actually, uh, I don't know what to do actually. Running out of crap to do. Not mainly on this game. We may we'll have to get rid of it. I hate to say, it, guys, but we may have to get rid of this game. We're gonna be all sixteen. I'm done. I don't know what to do with that game, guys. I like this game, but it just it's hard to get anything done on it. Like I said we're running out of stuff to do on most of these games now. Not on most of these games, but on main it remains running out of stuff to do on Well, mainly just that one. If I if I keep working towards me, my actually have a lot to do on other games. I'm actually gonna go and get this game over with man because of the fact that like out of all of them they're probably it's not gonna be the most boringest but it's not gonna be the best either. I'm gonna go and clean this tank out real quick. I gotta figure out which ones I need to breed. I don't know. I don't know which ones I did the last time, which ones I didn't. I'm gonna do this red and yellow. What does that? These two. I'm only four away from Dad Gumma new level.
Let's actually go ahead and um breed these two as well. I'm trying to get as many fish as I can. I'm trying. Well, actually, I want to sell them in a way, but I'm going to sell the guys that look the same. So I like that red with the one of the two red ones. I'm not going to sell this guy actually. I said that's one of the yellow, red ones. I see what fish we are from going up to level three. We can buy these two for that gun. Let's let's buy one actually. I wanna see I wanna see like it takes fifteen minutes to grow that up. I was just seeing. It's actually kind of a good thing though, because that means we can actually like be caught be like cautious with that one. I'm trying to think of which ones to sell. I kind of want to sell them all, but in their way. I'm going to go ahead and sell all the guys that have the, like, the little red and yellow pattern right here as well. Yeah. I know it seems weird guys, but we have plenty of eggs, so why would that matter? I'm gonna go and speed that one up. I'm trying to give them time to grow up. Like I said, that's just why I got rid of all of them, because they all were going with the same anyway, and hopefully that new fish right there actually was something different. It takes 15 minutes to grow, though. It's the only problem I have with it. Oh, that's a pretty one. It's a yellow and blue one. We well, see, we're just getting our fish back anyway. That's, that's the thing.
five minutes. Four minutes. Oh man, I probably made uh, five minutes, seven seconds. Four minutes. We know this one's gonna grow. Four minutes, fifty seconds. Can't tell which one's gonna grow fast. That one's definitely probably gonna grow the fastest. You next. I don't know. I'm trying to see which one it says two minutes. And that one, we click on it. Come on. Two minutes fifty six seconds for the one with the blue fin. Three minutes. That one's definitely not gonna grow the fastest. Definitely not you. So it's definitely gonna be that one with the blue fin at the top of its head. Right. Where'd it go? Where'd the one with the blue fin go? The one on top of its head. I know I saw it. Oh, this one, I believe. Yeah, I believe that one's it. Three. It won't let me click on it again. Oh my god. It seems sometimes it annoys me. Two. Two minutes thirty nine seconds. I think it's honestly only the one with the blue fan. I can't keep up though, so I have some of it. This is why this is also why I would regret hatching. I don't mind watching them grow around the same time, but like I also have to keep up with which one's gonna grow first too, so like this is why I should really just hatch like a minute after each other or something. I like hatch one and like the other ones kind of like do their thing kind of from there. Of course now I was kind of here if I did that and with so many eggs I sure like when I will hatch before the egg then if I try to go on I'm going to an adult for him so I don't want I don't want to grow them with gems. Well not the actual fish. I want to just hatch the egg like that. I meant in 10 for that one. So that one's definitely going to grow. That one just now reached the man 59 second mark. 58 seconds. A minute and 40. So it's definitely going to be that one with the blue fin up here. The one's definitely going to grow fastest. Once it grows, I'll check on everybody else. So I'll know which one. Or. What's going to happen from there? And what I'm kind of curious on what would happen, kind of. If like when I went behind the wall, we kind of and they came back out and they grew. Like I know, but just like them being a little big when they came back out, but kind of like they kind of kind of curious like what size it would go to. I wouldn't be no different. I'm just kind of curious. It's only got 19 seconds left. Going up. Eight seconds for that one. It's actually going to go, it went, I don't know, it didn't, it went, came back, yeah, there it goes. Good three seconds. 35. 28. This one. This one. So, the yellow one, this one, and this one.
that one's the one growing next. There you go. And it's one of these two up there. There you go. And that one right after. May not right after. There it is. They actually get pretty big though. Look how big they are. I'm gonna go and breed them. That one with the red is going to be pretty. I'm just trying to kind of breed them and speed the crap up. Because that, that red one right there I bought is going to have another like five minutes. Yo, we, we, don't we have one like that? What you got a duplicate of that one? Dang it. That one's about 5 minutes, 22 more seconds, so it'll be gross. I'm kind of curious how big that one actually is. And we do have enough, or we have, we have enough for the tank. See, this one's going to be a minute behind, so that's one reason why I want to wait. But at the same hand, I don't know how far this one's going to be behind from this dude. A minute behind, so that's good. I know, a few seconds behind, actually. A few seconds after this one grows up, he's going to grow up, so. I could, if I know I had a new tank though, I could just move the daggum fish over to the next one. Oh wow. Three minutes, four minutes. Okay, yellow and red have four minutes, the plain red one has two minutes, 37 seconds, and the yellow and blue one has two minutes, 45. So yellow, it's going to be the, yeah, the red, the plain red one, the plain red new one, and yellow and blue. Right. Plain red new one, and yellow and blue. And that one. And that one over there. And that's that yellow one, red one. Above it, actually.
This game can be fun, guys, but being not efficient means someone to grind. Five minutes and fifteen minutes one ain't that bad. You can kind of learn that. But like once you get into the hour ones, that's the one where you either have to speed up with them stuff or dad them like I'm gonna come back in an hour or something. That's kind of kind of hard for me to do. I might go on and just insta grow him because I really want to see that red one. That's going to be new to me. And plus, we know what that blue one's going to look like anyway. I don't know, though. I might not. Thirty-seven more cents for that one. Fifty cents for that one. So as soon as that red one grows, we all get that yellow and blue one. He's swinging really fast too. That little red one right here. Five. Oh my God. That one got insanely big. Now that one's gonna grow right after. There you go. Oh, why you need two of the same one? Kind of you do. Dang it, it sucks. As soon as that one, well, I think I want to try an experiment. I'm, I think I want to instantly. Grow, well, actually, no. I'm about to say I'm going to instantly grow this guy, and then like, if I have time, maybe when I get, when I come, if I if I ain't bored and want to do this do this game again, I will come back to it. I say if I'm not bored, I say if one of you didn't go, but bored did do a video. I've got other games to do after this one. I'm gonna let it grow real quick. We've got 15 more seconds. If it goes by a wall that itself, that'd be kind of good. But it seems like whenever it's about to grow, it don't ever do that. Look how big that red one is, and I like that. They seem to always get pretty big whenever they grow, except for that one. That one didn't get that big. That's all I'm going to do on this game for now, guys. I got other games to do. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do Dragon Village next. Because, like I said, we got a bunch of coins we can do, or a bunch of food we can do on here. And when I say a bunch of food, I really mean a bunch of food. We have. Plus, we just got a new dragon right here, but it ain't. We got that, plus, we got 10 gems, and we have enough to hatch it. And we have somewhere to put it as well. I got a bunch of new guys we can grow, so yeah. I'm gonna quickly see if we have any. I think we got a few new guys we can grow if we want to. I'm just trying to see, like, do we have anybody else? There was a few guys we could put in our inventory, but I didn't think about it at the time. So yeah, we got we got 651,000 food. We also got a new egg on the way. We don't have enough for that right now. Mainly right now, I'm just going to focus on growing the new guys. And like, if we have enough, I'll grow some of the ones that are at lower level. But right now, it's mainly just the babies. So we got plenty of food. I don't think we got as many babies as we did before. We got one in here. Whoopsie. Oh my god. We got one in we got one in here. 
one in here. And I think two in here, yeah. Like I said, it's not that many. I'm trying to make sure as well. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and grow this guy. Here's one of the guys we got anyway. The Firefly Dragon. I'm going to do the same thing I've been doing to show you how they grow. And then I'm going to go and grow them. So yeah. This game's one of the best games for getting stuff done because if you got so much, it's easy to get food in this game as well. So yeah, here's his first evolution. My only for his next evolution, he just gets a little bit bigger. As you can see. I'm going to go ahead and grab the, air, or the new guys first. And that's what we got. It's actually this air dude. This air dragon. He actually like changes with his evolution. He actually looks pretty cool with his final one. So yeah. As you can see. His final evolution is really cool. I like the look of the final evolution. Probably one of the cooler looking evolutions. I love the look of that. I don't know who would grow these guys. I've got this guy to grow next. This is one of the guys I bought off the store and hatched. Um, it's the nature guy. He, he, with his evolution, he just gets a little bit bigger, and I think it's just a little bit more of a darker green as well. So, yeah. Like, you see how he's a light green right now? He gets a little bit of a darker green when he grows up, plus gets a little bit bigger. See? He's a pretty cool looking thing, I love him. And this one, I can't quite remember it. Oh, yeah. His evolution kind of changes a good bit, and I like the look of him as well. Let's see, his first evolution was really cool, and then he gets even cooler with his final one. Let's see. I think that's all the bays we gotta grow. I'm just good. I'm really quickly going through this because we got a bunch of like guys we can get leveled up. Look if I, you know, you know this earth guy we grew in the beginning of the game. We've got plenty of food. In fact, we only used about a thousand of it with all them babies. We can actually like grow this earth dude to the next level, or like to like where the all the other dudes are to the. I can't add the word, but you know what I mean to to where everybody else is. We got plenty of food to do it. Like I could probably get in over thirty if I want to. Honestly, it would be not if it actually would that they were growing. Like. That's the thing about this game, is once you get past the revolution stages, they don't look like they're growing any bigger. At least in this game, they don't. I got him to level 22. Let's see if I can get him to level... Let's see if I can get everybody at least to level 22. I'm going to try to get everybody to round level 22. I'm just trying to get everybody to a high level. Don't blame them for doing that. I'm trying to get them all to level 22 if possible. And we all have food we still have. We've, we still got over 500,000. We have we ain't got everybody there yet.
I'm just really trying. I'm just trying to really give him over 22. I see we have plenty of stuff to do on this game. I was even like doing stuff with him. Oh my gosh, that thing. I know one thing I've noticed with this guy in Bowser, he's like one of the best guys in, like I've noticed like one of the pretty, one of the best guys in the game was what I've noticed. He's like really big in battle. I find that really awesome. I think I'm only going to get him all over 22 right now, that way they'll be at a higher level. And like if I... And I worry about getting more babies. I might like get them to the net, that level in the net. And whenever I get more babies, right now, like I had plenty of food. Like I still have like over two hundred thousand. Like they can't grow anymore. So what would be the point of trying to get them really any high except for the trying to win that battle is a lot easier. I know I missed one. We'll go and grab him in a minute. That's for us guy over there on the corner. I'll grab him in a minute. Oh wow, never mind. We're already down to a hundred and sixty-four thousand. I'm kind of curious. I mean, I should just increase one of the guys' levels up way higher than the other ones. I ain't gonna do that though and just put them all up to level 22 because, like, well, we got a lot of food and I want to kind of save some of that. Before we actually go move on to the, um, the, um, sea monster, I'm gonna go ahead and make sure real quick that it did save. I don't want to lose any of that progress. That whole 22 crap was amazing. It did, so we still have that ghost drowning in there. Plus, I see we have 107 food. Alright, so the last game we got on the south pad is this one. We've only got, like, two games to do on the other one. So, yeah, all we gotta do is we get, get quick. I did get a few things done, like, building this thing as well, which is a big farm. And I could get a lot more food that way, too. I do have enough to get up 2,000 food from this, but we'll take a but I don't have no villages to do it right now, so I'll have to, I'll have to wait until these get done. But, uh, actually we can get a lot more stuff done if we can keep that up. Unfortunately, I don't have enough to do it right now. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff I can, well right now there ain't a bunch of stuff I can do, but they will be pretty soon. Like my main goal now is to find out who, what I'm going to do because I only have 6,431, so I cannot be wasting it. I've got to use it on something like useful. I had somebody at level 5 and go ahead and grow him. I don't know where I put him though. Um, maybe right here. No, right here. There's a level 1 guy right there. I'm trying to remember, guys. There was a guy I had at level 5. I no, he's in this one. I think he'll be the first one I'll grow just to the fact that, like, He's the closest one to the evolution stage. I'm going to go and grow him. There we go. thing about him is only he grew that big. And that's the thing I don't like about some of these guys. He doesn't want to grow that big. For most of this game, though, I'm going to... Or for most of this, until we can get... Until I get all the guys to level 7. I think I'm mainly just going to focus on growing all the other guys to level 7. Guys that like a level 4, I'll get them to level 7. Like, for example, this dude, if we have enough. So, yeah, I'm going to go and try getting him. I'm going to kind of, I don't know how many I'm going to do for, 
I want to try to get as many as I can. I'm going to go and get him there. Let's see. We got this guy we can do. This guy's actually pretty awesome looking. I can't wait to grow him up there. I don't know if we'll get them all, but it looks like we're getting a lot of them done. Because I only used about a thousand. Maybe we'll be able to get four of them like that if they don't cost way too much. That thing's cross creepy. There we go. If I have enough to get, if I have enough to get on the level seven, I will. Or if I have enough to grow baby eyes, I will. But for now, it doesn't worry. I'm, I don't think I will. Honestly, it's already at three thousand. But we may be able to get them all to level seven today, or the ones that level four to level seven. So they will be a lot bigger. There's a baby guy right there, and then we got one over here. We got two baby guys to grow, and we got one more guy that need to get to level 7. If we get into level 7 and we still have enough to grow a baby, we will. We might actually have enough. Wow. We're actually going to get everybody to level 7. We actually already did. We actually got two baby guys we can grow. Oh, we also got another baby guy right here. But we need a war. Oh, no. The war of attack costs a lot of money. I don't know if we even have it yet. Huh? What? It said, it said war, didn't it? It's telling me to buy fire. Fire or war. Okay. Actually, that makes things a lot easier. Okay, okay, this is great, actually. So we have a third baby guy we can grow. That's a guy I actually got from beating the tournament. I actually was doing battles off camera, and I actually beat that, so I got this dude from it. Um, but I worry about growing him at another point. We also got a Megalodon short, but I kind of want to save him for a laugh because he's a cool looking animal. I'm actually going to save him for being one of the last animals I grow. So we're going to go ahead and do this little. I'm actually going to go ahead and grow this guy I just got. I don't know if we have enough to get them all, but if we can, I will. 200. If I do this guy, we won't have enough to do no more babies. Or not many more babies. Let's see, if I do 200, it'll be 600. That will be with 926. It definitely won't be enough to do many more babies. It will. I'm gonna go and grow some more babies instead of focusing on him since we have, we'd have a we'd have a lot more chance to get more babies if we did it this way. I want to try to save save some up for the megalodon too. There we go. That guy got pretty big. Instead of focusing, I'm gonna go ahead and I want to grow this guy, but I might go ahead and wait until I can until I can um grow until I can have enough food to get in the level seven. So honestly, I'd love to. We would have more to do. 
I'm going to go and show off some of the new guys. I never really show them off in battle, so I'd like to kind of see how they look as a bigger animal now. I'm going to go ahead and do these three. Like I say, they look pretty cool. Hey, that's actually a pretty good attack. I see the problem is, even with that, like we're still not doing the best. We're doing better, but we're still not doing the best, you know? I was surprised that we. We actually won. Wow. I honestly, we could keep doing that actually with Dad Gum. Let's see if we actually win these. If we can win these and Dad Gum have enough to grow that Megalodon, I will. I want to actually have enough to grow up Megalodon all the way to full stage, though. I don't want to dag him and leave, leave it. Oh my god. That one looks a lot bigger. What? Okay, which trail was that? I want that one. That one actually looks really neat. That's doing half, though, so I'm not mad about that if we can just actually knock, if we can knock it out. There we go. Oh, I like to look at that, dude. We're getting knocked out, yep. Oh no. Who's gonna be the last dude we just lost? Yes. We may actually be able to do this. Sometimes if you beat all the battles that was on that little list there, you can actually like get little monsters as rewards too, which is nice. Don't know if we'll be able to beat this last one, but we'll... No, we ain't gonna beat that. Yeah, there we went. Oh my gosh, like how these monsters look amazing. It's gonna take me out. I don't have enough gems to actually like, do it again either. What oh, sucks? I need five gems to retry this with the saint with one monster. We may have just won this barely. Wow, we just barely won it. Oh, we won battle away. Oh, well. Hey, the fact that we won it makes me shocked. And makes me happy as well. I'm going to see if it'll let me grow the food since we have enough. It takes 10 hours to grow it. But we'll have a lot more food if we do it that way as well. Plus, we can still grow these. Or at least on two of these farms. I don't know if we'll have enough for all three. No, we won't. Okay. We may have enough to eat. We'll have enough to either grow. We'll have enough to grow him all the way. Um, we'll have enough to him grow him all the way. Or we can try growing this Megalodon shark. I might go ahead and do that because I really want to grow him all the way instead of worrying about the other dude. This Megalodon's pretty big and I'd really like to have him. See, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do him instead. I said he gets pretty big, and I like the look of him as he's. See?
But yeah, we definitely have enough for him. Yeah, we got enough. He's about to grow fully. Look how big that thing is. I love the Megalodon. Well, with that, we got a lot accomplished on this game. No more, we don't. So we got one more game we can do. No, two more. Before we do, I want to make sure it saves. I oh, know we got one more game on here. Two more games on here. I just accidentally. Um, let me make sure it's saved because we got two other games we can go through. It did say because we got them. Yeah. Okay. I was making sure. I don't want to lose that prize. That was really good prize in that game. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and get done with this one. This game's fun, guys, but without new fish, this game gets kind of boring. I can mention the problem with this game as well is the fact that, like, also the fact that, like, some of the fish take forever to actually, like, grow or need to be fed to grow. Like, the butterfly fish grow pretty big, but, like, how are you gonna feed, how are you gonna feed them whenever they don't? I forget, because I don't. The wife who doesn't try to do this game for you guys, or the wife who never oh, actually gotten stuff for you. Not I ain't gonna help. The last few times I've tried buying stuff that way we have fish to grow in the next video. I don't know if I actually did for this video or not. I don't quite remember. I mean, it hasn't loaded up yet, so I don't know anything. I did. Okay, I was making sure I did. I don't remember if I did or not, so seeing this. Because normally, in, normally when I've done this game so far, I've bought some fish and stuff. That way, whenever we start next, we will have stuff to do, but. I couldn't remember if I did that or not. I'm going to watch a video and unlock this real quick. And we're going to... Can I mute? Is there not a mute button? I don't want to hear this. I could mute the volume, yes, but then you won't be able to hear the whole game either. I don't want to hear this crap game. Like, this, this game sucks. Trust me, this game sucks. Come on, man. Why is it way out like that? I ain't downloading this crap. What we get in front of? Maybe something good. Okay. I actually do have enough to upgrade this plant so it'll make it bigger, as you can see right there. So I'm actually going to go ahead and do that instead of putting these plants somewhere. So just show you kind of what it does. It makes the plant grow, and I think I think it like I kind of forget what it does. I think it kind of like doubles your coin thing or something like that. I don't quite remember though. Like, I really want to point. It does like in increase your coin collection because it went up from sixty to ninety now. Like you'll get a little more coins for getting it now. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get all these fish out of here. You can see I did get some butterfly fish and these seahorses. I tried completing the quest of. Um, the hatch to a disadvantage. See what's up, boy. There's a few quests I tried completing. I'm gonna go ahead and feed them real quick. Oh, wow! Oh, yeah, there's that new seahorse guy. I completely forgot I fed him. Anybody else hungry? Yeah. One thing I do like about this game is like you can kind of notice like the difference in the size of the fish as they grow. Cause, like if you have multiple of the same fish in there, you can kind of notice it's like the size difference. Like, for example, when, like, this fish grows, for example, like, whenever the, all the other fish are babies, you can see, like, the difference between a teenager and an adult, like, and stuff like that. But not really insanely cool. Like, see how this fish wants to be fed now? 
and now this one does too. Like now you can see what the difference between the growth. Like see. see well, you can kind of see the difference in the size and I like that how long does it take these guys to oh it takes them 20 minutes I don't want to keep thinking an hour I'm so used to other games that take like an hour just to feed them or grow them or something Like, see, I like the size of them. I like the coat. I like the size of these fish. I'm out of food. I'm out of I want to have enough coins to actually grow some of these butterfly fish, but I need to get rid of all these ones first. The bonus is this we can get double coins from decorations.
Oh man, I'm kind of walk. You see, the problem with this game is the fact that you can't. You can't really get no. Oh wow, I had enough to place both in decorations too. I may have to go off camera and just wait for these decorations to do their work. So honestly, I don't look here. Like, I'm running out of food just to feed my animals anymore. That's the big problem with this game. I like this game, but there's this big old problem right here. to do this off camera. There's, I wanted to get more food off camera, guys. Like I said, this game's going to be difficult to do without that. So I mean, this game ain't got much to do either. Um, so yeah. <laughs> now what we got to do is grow two fish that I've gotten that are new. And we also got another one of these guys. And the main reason I, I did get more of these purple looking uh, these guys, but I already grew them and got rid of them because they suck. I hate those things. I'd honestly get rid of that red one if it wasn't a shiny kind of thing. So, yeah. Because we've seen one of these guys before, and actually, since we already have one, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of him. So, in fact, we're about to get another one anyway. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and grow him. There he is. And then we got two other ones we got. This thing, which is creepy looking. Which is super ugly looking. And then we got this thing called the strange fish. Which is pretty cute. Uh, all the, uh, yeah. Is there an ad or something? Yep. Skip that. I'm gonna see if it'll let me breed some of these new fish. You with you. Takes 14 hours for that. We have a lot of coins. You with the swordfish. And then we have I was just trying to get some stuff out of the I'm going to take a long time as you can see we're only one pearl. And yeah, I'll take a long time so yeah, we can get nothing for a while. You know, oh, since we have enough, I'm going to go and this tank as well. That's all there is to do with guys in this game. I'm sorry that some of the games didn't last that long. <laughs> like the last two games have been these two right here. Um, but I promise we'll make up for that whenever we, uh, whenever I get more stuff to do. Like I said, since we got that big food form and that, that, uh, sea monster sea, we'll have a lot more to do now. All we gotta do is keep up with the coins. 
So yeah. We only get we only got two more games to do. We only, got, oh, we only got two more games to do, and one I'm really looking forward to is we got a bunch of new, a bunch of new guys. What's we gonna do? I would say three games on here, guys, but that point he still hasn't got nothing for us to do in it. I'm gonna go ahead and show you that real quick. We're gonna make sure the blinds all the way down. No. Not in the system. Okay, there we go. Um The daily bonus still has 35 more minutes. Or no, 50 more minutes. But as you can see, it ain't none. It ain't even the purple thing. We still got three more days for those. So for a little while, that'll be one of the we'll get nothing done in. So the fact that like it's gonna take a long time for us to get anything. So yeah, that game we have nothing to do in. The Jurassic Pixel Craft we will have a lot to do in, but I'm gonna save that one for last. We're gonna go and do this new game called Tiny Farm. We get to we get to raise animals. I'm gonna let it load. This game might be pretty cool. They did have a little bit of a tutorial where they gave you some sheep, but I actually sold those sheep. I'm actually gonna show you some different animals. If it lets me get a cow, but we'll show you a cow. The cow's my favorite farm animal. Oh wait, you gotta wait for it to start, guys. It takes a minute. There's different kind of animals you can get, but basically you gotta raise yeah. animals, which is kinda of neat. Unfortunately it does take a while to load, which kinda of stinks. Yeah, I see. It's like even little daily bonds you can get. But that ain't really what matters. I'm just gonna, gonna check out this game works. There's nothing on this farm else I got rid of animals that you did have. There's even like little rewards you can get. I'm gonna go and collect those because I might need those. These bells I'm getting, the ones I just got right there, are actually very important because they're actually gonna help me grow my animals a lot quicker. No, you have to wait to grow your animals, but most of the time, and it's the only showing you grow, me growing my animals like, like right off the bat. Um, so yeah, if I think cows are going to show you those. I'm trying to get to the animals, but it was kind of covered up by all that. We do have some cows right there. I won't go and get some of those. We also have a brown cow which I'm gonna go and collect as well. Which is a pig. Like I said, my mom's gonna show you like them growing real quick, and that's about it. It's not gonna be the best game, but it's, it's kind of cool. I'm trying to build a museum anymore, but I don't think it will. 
basically if you click on the animal and like you wait a little while which for the pig it's an hour you can like feed them and they'll grow them for the first time you do this it actually is free but like you can grow them with them bells I just got I don't I have 14 bells so yeah I'm gonna go and use that to grow this animal well, as you see it will grow them and like past the first bell it probably takes a it takes um some it takes a bell past the first one I was trying to make sure if they didn't grow anymore I'm trying to show that real quick I'm gonna go and do the cows real quick as well I don't know if it's supposed to happen three times or not, but it's pretty cool. I love the cow. Oh. Well, let me zoom in that time. You know what? I'm going to go and sell this guy. We're going to redo it since it just now let me zoom in. The cows are special because like I said cows my favorite farm animal, farm animal in general. I want to take a cow to grow one at about two hours. I'm going to show you that real quick. I wonder why I showed that one three times a while ago. Oh god, it takes four now. I'm gonna go ahead and grow this cow this time since it's, I think it costs a little bit less. And I think for each one, it also only costs one. Yeah, see, it only costs one. I see if it would grow anymore. I'm going by another cow. Well, I said the main thing about this game is the fact that you can raise animals. I am going to go ahead and grow this this cow this one time since we got enough. That's all I want to. If we have enough, we'll go ahead and grow. Um, I'll go in, I think we have enough to grow another cow. So my, the cows are my favorite farm animal, guys, so don't blame me for growing more cows than you think. The cows are definitely my favorite farm animal. Instead of, I want to see how they grow from, from a baby to an adult with this. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wow. I can't tell if that's a glitch or it's actually supposed to have them. That's pretty cool. Like I said, if I can keep collecting bells, I'll have a lot more fun with the game. But until then, this game ain't going to be that good. I'm gonna go ahead and grow him so you can see it. There you go. I wonder if we have any more animals in here. 
I want to grow them, but I want to do okay. I'm gonna do one more cow. I love cows so much, guys. Don't blame me again. I'm gonna go and click the another reward. We got an extra bell for going to level six. I'm going to get a little bit bigger, but. I'm trying to see if they grow any more. Is that one a lot? Why does that one look bigger? I notice how that one, this one looks bigger. I can't tell. See, that one didn't get that big. It grew a little bit, but not that big. See, that one grew one one section too as well you see how it grew glued glued once and that's it let's see if that one does the same this one does the same thing it grows more than once that's so weird how they only do it once I see if this pig grows anymore. No. I know if I want to, I could breed them, but I need more. I need Um, I know in this game, you know, it's easy to breed them. All you gotta do is give them a little by tap on the little hearts you see right there. And, like, once they get enough, you can, like, breed them. Like, I don't know if I'll have enough to grow them, but if I can. We got a pink cow for doing it as well. I should have done that instead of getting multiple of the same cows, honestly. Like, now... There we go. I'm trying to see what the difference between the growth stage is, honestly. I want to see how they grow. I'm going to grow this one. Since it's free for this one, I'm going to go ahead and grow it. Dang it. Oh well. Once I get more bells, guys, I'll do it off camera. Or once I get more bells, I'll do more of this on camera until then. Once I get more bells, guys, I'll do this on camera, but until then, there's no way I'm doing any more of this on camera. The game's fun, but I prefer doing it when there's a bunch of bells, you because know, I'm not sitting there waiting. That's one of the things that takes a long time if you don't have the bells. Dial Pixel Curve is one of them we actually have a lot to do this time, because in fact that... Because we actually got a bunch of food. Plus a bunch of dragons we can grow. I I got rid of the adult guys we had last episode. I actually got them back as babies. And plus some new ones as well. 
I didn't see what this guy. And we got 15,000 food. I said 12,000, but that was a mistake. We got some new guys we can grow this time. So, yeah. I won't go and get the guys we already grew last time first and then we'll worry about more of them in a little bit. I said I won't go ahead and do the guys I've already done before. I didn't see. I'm probably going to get them at least to level 10. All the baby dudes or something. And if I have enough past that, I will. But for now, level 10 will be the max I'll we'll be on to. There we go. I'm really trying to grow them. Some of these don't get that big. I think so. I swear it was like some of them are growing bigger and bigger as you go on, but I can't tell. I'm actually going to go ahead and grow some of these guys like old 15 and all that. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and grow these other guys right now. Because I already got us down to 13,000. I want to go into these other dudes growing. We got one guy in the fire habitat, one guy in here, one guy in here. And one guy in here. Okay. I just got two guys in here. For, oh yeah, one of that water guy all over again. I'm gonna go ahead and do him after I've seen him. If we have enough to get him to higher levels, I will, but for now, I'm just gonna get him up to level 7. I forgot one was actually one we've already done before. Here's the new guy. I might even go in and I think get him next. I think he's like the shortest of all of them. So yeah, I'm gonna go and grow him next. Yeah, see how small he is even despite. Like see, he didn't get that big at all. He might be getting a little bit bigger though, like I said. I might want to get him to level 10, that's about where I'm going to stop him. I'm going to look about... Yeah, I think they're getting a little bit bigger. Well, like I said, I can't really do anything about it right now. I'm only just trying to get all the baby dudes growing up. We got one in here. One here. One here. And one here. I'm going to go and do this one here first because it's basically a little 
Oh, Spinosaurus or whatever. It's kind, of, it's kind of small though. It's probably gonna be small. So yeah. He grew pretty big. He's pretty cool looking as well. Okay, he grew pretty big. I like the look of him. Two in here. The two in here. I'm trying to make sure which one's gonna dig you because I want to grow them. I'm gonna go and do this guy that's in here alone. I don't know how big he's gonna get, but I have a feel, of course. Who knows? Okay. He got pretty big. Again, he got pretty big. Not the biggest, but pretty big. I think whichever one gets, whichever one of these guys get the biggest, the one I'm going to dad gun like grow a little bit higher level. This guy kind of safe for us as well, because in fact, I think he's the one that's actually going to get the biggest. He's pretty cool looking as well. So he's getting pretty big. I had over 20. I'm going to try to get the fire up over 20 as well. There we go. Alright. I did say I would do. I did say again that I would do. I did say again that I would do the game again if I wasn't bored or whatever. Unfortunately, again, I am getting all bored. So, I am really sorry about that, guys. But, I am planning on doing another project again. Don't worry. When I get a chance to, I'm planning on doing my Let's Play. I think of Pokemon Omega Ruby next. Either that or I might spend one spot with Wesco Pikachu, I don't know. I might do Pokemon Mech Ruby, that's since I got part of one of that already on there. Um, so yeah. I'm sorry about the kind of fail I did say we have. It may get to a point where these videos might come to a, come to a stopping point. I love these games, guys, but... Don't get me wrong, they're gonna get boring, if, they're gonna get boring sometimes. But if you want to want to stop completely for a long time, for a little bit. So yeah, guys, like, we're getting full of Magikarp junk. And every game but that um, time for once the only and that first clouds and sheep one of the only ones that I have gotten still gotten entertained by. Anyway guys I hope you enjoyed see you for the next video. Bye bye everyone, have a wonderful day.